This year's matters the celebrations for the Anglican Church are headed by the Anglicans of Eastern Cluster. The cluster is calling for Christians to fundraise towards preparation of the function. We have raised 200 million, 554,800. We still need more, so we want to appeal to the dioceses to up their contribution. We want to appeal to the laity to do more so that we have a memorable day on the 3rd of June. The first deputy prime minister, also minister of East African Affairs, Rebecca Latwala Kadaga, has mobilized Eastern dioceses to organize for the moving pilgrims. So far, uh, we have been able to start with the organizations, and the organizations are going on well. It is now our duty to invite all of you uh, from far and near to come and take part uh, in these celebrations. Some people are going to walk, others are going to run, and others are going to come by bus in order to come and stand and identify uh, with the Uganda matters. Uh, I'm now asking the people of Uganda to make a difference, especially the Christians in the Eastern dioceses, to make pilgrimages from each of the dioceses. They should do, make a pilgrimage from Karamoja, North Karamoja, from Mbale, from Sebei, MTN Uganda has committed full support during this year's celebrations with cash of 10 million shillings and provisional refreshments to the moving pilgrims. This spirit of generosity that makes the Matters Day celebrations so special and meaningful. Our contribution towards the smooth running of the Uganda Matters, uh, celebration, Uganda Matters Day celebrations include uh, live coverage of the pilgrims uh, and set up support points at different resting points where we'll give a lot of communication and other MTN services offered to the community. The team managed to raise 73 million shillings during the dinner and the patron appealed to the Christians and other well wishes to support the cause. Abdul Nasir Lubwama and Rogers Komagum for ABC.